All right, y'all, what's going on? What's going on? All right, so today I'm eating Burger King. I'm trying the new chicken, um, chicken sandwich, okay? So if you're new to the channel, please, please, please subscribe to the channel and subscribe. Even if you aren't, if you haven't subscribed, definitely go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell so you get notifications the next time I post a video. Leave us some comments down below. Let us know things you like to see us try, things you like to see us cook, interact with us. Would you like to hear from me? I'm going to say grace and get started. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this food that we're about to receive. For the nourishment of our bodies and health, in Jesus' name we pray, amen. You know what, I'm tripping. I ain't put no beard on my hands. Oh, well. So I got some jalapeno poppers. Anyway, I think I, I forget what this is. It's like this little stacker thing or something. And then I got the chicken, the chicken sandwich, which, is it not the same chicken sandwich I had? They just call it different? Just call it something different? I don't know, but I got the deluxe one this time instead of getting the spicy one. Mm. They were fresh, but I had to come home. I'll tell y'all in a second. That's a nice big salad. Mmm. Mmm. I don't know, y'all. I really think. Mm -hmm. What do you want? Come on. I really think that Burger King is, might be my favorite spicy, my favorite chicken sandwich. Like, mm -hmm. I just like the flavor of the chicken, like. That's so good. And I feel like, and listen, I could be tripping. I could also just be hungry. But I haven't really eaten lunch today. Um, I feel like the other ones... I don't really know if the chicken, the chicken patty itself, like, has flavor, and it sort of gets its flavor from the, um, the sauce. And like all the other places, they have brioche buns, but this bun is just so good. I don't know, man. I mean... I will say that um, I do like Chick Fil A's. Um, I mean, I like them all. Let me just say, I like them all. Haven't had one that I don't like, but I don't know why Burger Kings is standing out to me. I don't. What? The third time I had now. The first regular one, the other two are spicy. I like how Burger King is different as well in that theirs is more so. What's wrong? Huh? You want any? Oh, it's okay. <laughs> Why you got to do my onion ring like this? Oh, I was going to say that I think, I guess there is are is sort of like a Nashville hot chicken, which I think I might have said that the second time I had it. But their, their spicy chicken sandwich is definitely giving you Nashville hot chicken vibes with how they coat the whole chicken breast in the, in the sauce versus just putting it on, you know, on top like the other chicken sandwich places or the other places that offer chicken sandwiches. Well, shoot. 
I don't know. They all good. M- McDonald's was good too, and the, the one time I had it was fresh. Like, but the first time I had the Burger King one it was fresh. Like that, I had to wait for them to cook it. You got water. Your girl is tired and exhausted. I like this little dress I got on. I've got this. Um, you're not going to be able to see it, but I like it because it's like, it's longer than I remembered it being or, I don't know, it's a, it's a long dress. Well past my knees. Real old lady-ish. No, I'm just playing. Uh, uh, <laughs> um, but it's flowy. Has a little belt on it, it's super cute. And then um, I bought this dress when I was trying to figure out what me and the boys were gonna wear for our pictures. And I had found them shirts that looked alike. And if y'all remember our pictures or whatever, um, their shirts were like blue and like navy blue and this sort of green. So I was either going to wear all blue or all green to like match them. I got them those shirts and then I got them um, green. Um, so yeah, I was, but I ended up wearing a navy blue dress. <laughs> navy blue is like becoming my favorite color to wear. <laughs> Probably where to work, really. And I don't know why, because it's so challenging to find like navy blue stuff. Well, let me say navy blue shoes. I finally found some really cute ones, though. I found some open toe ones. Um, where did I find these at? Maybe, maybe I got them at Kohl's. I'm so. I think I got them at Kohl's because they're a Lauren Conrad shoe. And they're just like a strappy sandal, like your toes are out. And then the, the heel is like a chunky heel. I like stilettos, but if I'm going to be wearing heels to work and walking around all day, I need some a heel with more, you know, more support. So don't get me wrong. The Lettos Pumps in the club. No, I'm just playing. Uh, <laughs> but don't get me wrong, okay? I will rock a stiletto when I get plenty of them. But I really love that next that I found. Yeah. Super cute. So your girl is tired, okay? Today has been a long day, but and I'm thankful that it's over. <laughs> and like this huge kind of season or chapter of my life has just kind of like been hanging over my head for like the last year and it finally came to a come like to an end today and I'm just so relieved I feel like I have something too, y'all. 
I forgot. But anywho, I have to go up in that. I have to go up in the job today, y'all. It's so cool that people know who I am, even with my mask on. Like, so somebody I used to work at my old employer with. We both found out. I think he left my old employer to come to my current employer, and I think he did before I did. And we happened to be on some call or something like that, and found out that we both work here. <clears throat> and we caught up for a little bit. Well, I saw him when I was coming into work today. I saw him coming out the building, and I was like, "Oh!" And he knew who I. I don't know how he recognized me. I don't. Well. I guess probably, yeah, maybe about that time when he was there, when we worked in the same area. I guess I was natural, so. But I just thought that was interesting that he, like, knew who I was. Actually, maybe we, maybe we had been on a meeting since the panty. Maybe that's what happened. Yeah, I think that's what happened. So, of course, I look like how I look, you know. We were on set, whatever call we were on, and then um, he like, you know, messaged me afterwards, and we just caught up for a little bit. Wawa. You got Wawa? Don't put it. Yeah, put it up there. There you go. So, um, I mean, I fully really expect, like, people who, uh, you know, I work with closely or whatever for them to recognize me, even with my mask on, but, you know, I don't feel like I haven't seen him in months. And he was like, hey, Sonny, I'm like, okay, hey. I was talking to him yesterday. Oh, Up and down the coast of California. I'm just gonna take like a bite, bite of this. I really want a nap. A near is naive. But that's good. Oh, that's what I'm gonna tell y'all. So, um, the reason why I hadn't um, eaten right when I got home is because. My bed, uh, well, I, I ordered I ordered my bed before I even moved in my house, but I ordered a mattress like maybe the week before I planned on moving in. Um, it was supposed to be here on June 1st or 2nd, maybe the 1st. I think it was the day, excuse me, that I went back to work, it was. Um, and... You know, that day came when it ain't come. And then, like, a week later, I, you know, I called, I ordered it from Wayfair, and I called him. I'm like, hey, uh, you know, this thing says I was supposed to have gotten my bed, you know, last, or, you know, a week ago, and having, like, the status, the shipment status hadn't changed or whatever. So I'm like, uh, you know, I just wanted a status update on the shipping or whatever. And they were like, yeah, that's weird. Like, so they were supposed to, like, the supplier was supposed to reach out to them or they reached out to the supplier and they had 24 hours to give them an update of when it would ship um and they didn't call me back the next day but they they did end up calling me the day after that 
and end up like giving me a discount and like canceling the order and reordering the same mattress that I ordered. And um, yeah, that happened. I want to say I ordered it last week around this time, I think. And uh, and then it. Sh when did I get my notification that it shipped? Um, what's today? Thursday. I think I got the notification it shipped on Tuesday or was it yesterday? I don't know. I think it was yesterday actually, and but it got shipped via FedEx. So, anywho, I get here and. They didn't even, maybe it was just too heavy for them, I don't know, but they didn't even put that thing on the porch. They just kind of put it in front of my steps. I don't know how long it's been out here. I've been gone from my house since six something in the morning. And I got back after, what time is it now? So I got back almost six, 12 hours later. But, I mean, thankfully I live in a good, but ain't nobody, who, where are they going, this mattress was heavy though, like I don't even know how I'm going to get it upstairs because I barely got it in the house. <laughs> but, now that I got my mattress, I can finally, I'll finally put my bed together, but I'm not really in a rush to do that, I may do that on Saturday. check my cameras to see what will really transpire one time um i thought i had this thing notify me man i need to change my notification settings because i don't really want to be notified of like because that thing be saying that you know detecting people even though sometimes people don't even be in front of the dang on doors but I do want to know when I get a package, you know. Um, so I'm going to look on the camera and see what happened there. But one time, um, an Amazon girl, she delivered something. And when I said... It whistles and then it said it says camera recording. And so when it said camera recording, she just waved, she said, mm -hmm. Now I oh don't know. Oh, two more things. Hopefully I remember both of them. But the first thing is I went on the IRS website because I was trying to change my address or whatever. Because um, I still got a key to the old mailbox, but I need to keep checking it because I'm expecting something. I don't know if they changed, you know, my address. I'm going to tell you, basically, I had to amend my tax return and um, because I forgot to claim this one um, credit or whatever and so that means I'm getting more money back right and um, but I didn't know like if they would address they gonna send it to or whatever right so and I can't remember what I wasn't fully living in my house but I was I had owned my house by the time I did that amendment but I don't know so I was going on the web the IRS website to make sure my address is updated so possibly if they send me anything it'll be they'll send it to my house or whatever because I also don't know how long you know my apartment or that mailbox will be vacant before you know somebody starts is able to receive mail there so that's the thing and don't know if they assign the same mailbox numbers to the same, you know, apartment, like apartment units, you know. And click, and my name is still on that dang on, like the little address slip or whatever. And I got my mail forwarded, but somehow, well, 
one thing is name deviations have not forwarded so that's another thing i need to i keep telling myself that i need to check the mail forwarding or whatever thing that i did just to make sure that i mean a middle initial shouldn't matter but something had a middle initial and they it went to my old address instead of my new one or whatever and like i've definitely been forwarded my address or whatever or my mail or whatever so anywho all that to say i went on the dang on iris website and y'all when i logged in why was my address changed already i said the iris is stalking me what's going on or maybe i possibly could have did it already and but i don't I don't recall doing it for real, so I don't know how they got my new information. And then I said I was going. I knew I was going to forget the second thing. Dang it, mommy! Hmm. Y'all, I legit forgot the second thing I was about to tell y'all. It's a sad. Was it male related? It's gone. All right, it's gone. It's gone. So that's it. That's all I got. <laughs> all right, well, thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave us some comments down below. Let us know. Thank you for watching us try. Thank you for watching us cook. Interact with us because we do like to hear from you. And subscribe to the channel. Go ahead and subscribe. And hit that bell so you get notifications the next time we post a video. We'll see you in the next one. Peace out. I'm really sorry. I forgot that second thing. I'm too young for this, y'all. I'm too young for this, Grayson.